Good. Yeah. Um, I just realized I got a, one thing I haven't done in the past that I really want to do and I'm going to do is put together like a list of things that I want to do. So I don't waste any time while I'm there. I don't sit in my hotel. Um, because usually it's like, I'm so exhausted or like anxious or busy from traveling that Mm -hmm. it's like, I rest, play the show. I maybe get some food. I go walk around a little bit, but I don't get, you know, maybe go to a bar, but I don't get too much of a chance to explore that much. And this time I'm like, I'm almost 30 now. It's time for me to, (laughs) when I come, it's time for me to like really have a, a schedule and like go places and do stuff. So, yeah. So crazy. I mean, that one was, um, yeah, that, that was, that was huge. And, um, I'm just, yeah, I'm just even more excited to experience that in India. Um, cause it's been one, it's been a minute since I've, you know, played in India and La Palooza in general was such a special vibe. And I think, um, getting to do that there is just going to be, um, even more iconic. So I'm excited. Yeah. Um, well, it's, it's going to be very personal, but also very, um, very large scale, very emotional. Um, uh, I've really been over the years, kind of like the set, I've been kind of evolving the way I, I do, I do the sets and it's like, maybe there'll be some medleys. Um, there'll be, uh, a great mixture of just like all of my the eras of my music um but um yeah i'm actually still like finalizing stuff so there's still i'm like i realize i have an opportunity right now to just kind of like even feel it out a little bit more so um yeah who knows maybe, maybe I, I also sometimes like to change things close to last minute so we'll see yeah wow that was um so so unexpected it was just like i was just doing my thing and then to get the call to do a song for a pixar film was just like really crazy and um and so i like went in and um met the team and um learned about the film and the story the inspiration behind it got to see some early um like screens of it and like when it was just drawings and um and they're like okay like we this is the part we need a song for And I was like, cool, no pressure at all. Like, I got this. Like, I was just pretending like, oh, like, yeah, yeah, yeah." like just another day. And I'm like, no, it's not just another day. This is is crazy. And um, and then, yeah, then I got to go in with uh, this guy, Thomas Newman, who's, you know, scoring, who is scoring the film and he's done a bunch of their films. And um, that was a whole experience in and of itself because it's like, I'd never really worked with a composer like that. Um, And he was so cool and so just raw and and appreciative and so talented and so like just cool like i don't know just so experienced and um that was that was that was dope and the song happened really naturally it was just very like organic very organic um took a little bit of work and then suddenly it was done and then you know next thing i knew it i'm going to the premiere and oh my god there's my song an elemental and that was crazy so yeah that was that was a really that was a cool ride he so he was he was the guy i gotta give him the credit in terms of the like the sound a lot of the sounds i um because he i think he was um part of his yeah part of his i think job uh and approach to the film was um you know yeah like defining a sonic identity so like truth be told like when i came in and started working on the song um he sent me some of those like early loops of like the like um some of the like the main the some of those main kind of like textures and sounds some of those strings and stuff and then i kind of wrote the chords on a on a piano and then wrote the lyrics and melody but he was really he's really the 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 guy behind the um behind a lot of the like yeah a lot of the core sounds that really I think maybe give some of that some of that vibe yeah yeah I feel like it's like really up to me to like be there and just be like honoring you know everything that's happening around me um which I think a younger me 
not that I've ever not wanted to do that. I've always wanted to do that. But the younger me, I think was so, so focused on the anxiety of like, you know, like what's happening, what's happening, you know, like, am I going to get through this? Like, what, what are people going to think? Blah, 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 blah. And I'm just excited to come and for, you know, for La Palooza, but also this other show too, like be more, um, be more there. Just like, I don't know. I feel like I have the confidence in myself at this point where I'm not so like worried about how people see me and, and I can actually be present for like all of the amazing things going on around me, you know? Um, so I'm really excited for that. And I think there's a lot for me that I can learn and, um, and uh, yeah, I just hope for some cool experiences in that, in that way. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So, okay. I am like very, very, very deep in my album. It's, I have, I had a meeting yesterday where I was like, okay, I have way more than like, I probably have like five albums worth of songs that are really good. Um, if I could say so myself, um, if I'm allowed to say that. And um, I um, it's just that now I just got to finish them all and um, start putting music out. And um, I've been really lucky that I've had time to just kind of reflect on my life and make some changes for me and really focus on myself as a person and like what makes me happy. And now it's time to bring it all back. And um, yeah, I have like really big, really, really big aspirations for the music and outside of music. Um, a lot of things that I want to do this year that um, I'm really excited to, I just am excited to grow into. So it's going to be, it's going to be like a very, I think the most expansive year yet for me, just on a lot of levels. So I'm really excited. Yeah. I didn't even, I, honestly, I, I I didn't even know anything about like the news necessarily, but um, uh, yeah, that was a really fun tour. And um, I got some, some very good, very good memories of Ed just vibing and um and um i yeah i'd love to go and experience some more some more parties too i think that'd be really fun um yeah great times great times <laughs>